Welcome everyone, I'm Martin Tyler, he's Alan Smith, and we're going to talk about this match today from the commentary position. Hi there, Martin. Yeah, and expecting big things here, there's a great atmosphere. And our match here is St Pauli against Stoke City. Very established these days, Stoke City is a Premier League team. Great credit to the owners of the club who have backed various managers. Oh, they were fantastic, weren't they? Peter Coates and his colleagues. They really did lead with intelligence and generosity too. Well, this is how the home team shape up. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4-5-1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated. Otherwise, this formation will not work. Stoke City team, here it is for you. Jack Butland starts in goal. Kurt Zuma starts with Eric Peters as the fullbacks in attack. Peter Crouch partners together with Man Biram Juf. Graham Bovrick is the referee today. So we start with the kickoff, and I must say, both of us up here are really looking forward to this match. Into the attacking third. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Bauer. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Now Joe Allen. Into the box it goes, along the ground. And they get it away. Some potential in this move. Nice bit of interplay between these two. Good screening, and he's kept the ball. Neatly intercepted. to Allen and yeah this could lead to a chance it's good attacking play good work really to read the intention of the pass and that will be a throw Kurtzuma he's very confident with the ball at his feet and Biran Juf. Shakiri. And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Park. The referee had a good look at that, decided it's just a throw after the tackle. Read by the defender. They've got them. The shot's on. Very, very close. Just past the post. Well, I think half the crowd, you know, thought that was going to nestle in the corner of the net there.
here's Crouch getting forward well as a team now nice return pass Crouch Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Well, a corner to come because of that deflection. Not quite good enough so far, Alan. Well, he's got into good positions, but I don't know whether his confidence is low. He's had some opportunities to test the keeper, maybe put his team ahead, but it hasn't happened. And in it goes. Zuma! Oh, he's got it off the line. That's amazing defending. Well, that's what defenders are for when the goalkeeper's beaten, and he was there. Kurt Zuma. And now the shot! It was an opportunity, really. And in the end, way off target with that place shot. Yeah. It's looking good this move. They're grateful for that to have an intervention like that and get back on the ball when they're defending so much. Well, that's good defending. Two minutes left. That's added time. There is the half-time whistle, nil-nil at the break. It seemed quite a long wait for that half-time whistle. We've not really been kept on the edge of our seats here. And I'm sure there's better to come in the second half. Well, you'd hope so. They're trying to show the first-half highlights up on the big screen, but it's only lasted a couple of seconds. It was instantly forgettable, that. They kick off at the start of the second half. Joe Allen. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Made the challenge well. Presented possession to the opposition now. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. He's had a go here. Well, it looked a bad miss. I think the defender just put him off. Yeah, he's got to take a lot of credit for that because uh, he had to take the shot quickly, the lad who was trying to score. Bauer Peter Crouch good forward play from them yeah check here's the shot got in the way corner for Stoke City In from Shakiri. Not really away from the threat here. And shoots! Magnificent from the goalkeeper. Well, it's all about positioning and spreading his body. Top class keeping. There's been plenty of warming up going on, and now I think one of the substitutes will be brought into the game. In goes the corner. There's a chance, really, of getting into a scoring position then, but anything but. The 
good screening, and he's kept the ball. It's an advantage for Stoke City, signals the referee. It's a turnover of possession here. Into the attacking third. They've opened them up here. They've scored. And they've gone into the lead. And undoubtedly deserved. They have been by far the superior side. And they really impose their will on the opposition. Too good, really, for the defending. And the shot in the end, far too good for the goalkeeper. In truth, Alan, this is what we expected. The dominant side and they're showing that on the scoreline yeah we don't always get what we expect but uh, they've been good value here they've played well particularly the strikers stoke city have the lead They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Shot off! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Christopher Brooksman. Good position, they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. And it's going to be a goal kick. But it might be a good idea just to get a fresh player on and cement their position as they look to hold on to this lead. Joe Allen to Allen that's a good spot by the defender there's some potential in this move he has been pressed there to running the ball out of play corner now comes the corner defended well he's stolen it back from the opposition good tackle Kurt Zuma Mambir Anjouf trying to run off the shoulder of the last player offside that is a weakness in his game gets caught offside too many times Oh, a bad day all round. Didn't play well. Picked up a yellow, and now he's been subbed. Still, as we are on the scoreline, but there's still time, even this late in the game, for a twist to the tail. Getting forward well as a team now. Juf in possession. Bit of keep ball going on here. Now Joe Allen, he's got his shot off now. Oh, nowhere near. No, he's miscued that one, miscued it badly. An important time for this manager here, trying to manage the situation and keep the lead, and making this substitution with that game management in mind. Well, there's a big support here for them. Those supporters want to see just a little bit more in the time that remains. Well, there's always pressure on you when you're playing in front of a big crowd, your own fans, and the players have shown a few nerves out there today. They've got to lose those. And the decision for the added time is three minutes. And here's the shot. Well, that 
that's the end of the game. Well, given their status in the match, Alan, clearly underdogs, uh, they'll be pretty happy with the way they played. I think so, yeah. They can take a lot from this performance moving forward. Might not have got the result they wanted, but they did well. well I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Oh, lots of energy, lots of quality, and a good goal, along with plenty of chances.